Yes, you're absolutely right, Catherine. There is a relevance to the clear skies that have been brought by the tropical system that we have been tracking, which is pulling away from land mesh. It's good, good news and the good weather accompanied with that. But the bad weather also has happened across the Chichijima as this system raced over across the Pacific coast, mainly across the western areas and Izu Islands, especially about six meters high waves. And anywhere along the Pacific so coast of Japan, we're likely to see about three to five meters high waves because the winds are gusting still about 126 kilometers per hour in the center of this system. As I mentioned, it is pulling away uh, and clear skies are uh, brought by this because the dry air is covering much of the um, country with the high pressure system located over the uh, whole of Archipelago. But the Mount Ontake where the volcano has erupted, the clear skies are helping to cooperate with this search process which has resumed today and it will be continuing to be clear into tomorrow. Maybe a little bit of showers will be pulling in from the nighttime, which is going to be a bad news for the mud flow that could happen from that. We have a stationary boundary stretching over Guizhou and then moving into Zhejiang. Well, Zhejiang already has received about 55 millimeters of rainfall, and that's likely to pull down as it brings about 120 millimeters of additional rainfall. The good news, it'll be moving out towards the water, and the hot and humid air will be weakening. Uh, we're likely to see another tropical cool depression that will be moving uh, towards uh, some of the islands across the Mariana, so we'll keep a very close eye on this. But uh, meanwhile, very messy in Manila at 33 degrees. We're likely to see clear skies here in Tokyo at 27 with partly uh, cloudy skies. Here across the U.S., uh, the midsection will be messy, especially in the four corners due to a uh, low-pressure system and the front that's switching all the way out towards Canada. This is bringing uh, isolated damaging winds as well as a uh, large hail. Still has the capability of bringing flash floods to southwestern areas of Colorado. Very messy in the deep south in the Florida panhandle. Miami at 30 degrees, so all the way down towards Miami. Thunderstorms will be out here across uh, Europe. Very messy in the north and towards the south. Let me first about talk about here in uh, the Imbarian Peninsula where scattered thunderstorms will be capable of popping up again. And that system is pulling all the way out towards the north, but Norway could possibly see some mixed precipitation. Clear and fine across much of the central locations. So take a look at this. Warsaw, Vienna, 20 degrees. Kiev, where the very important active Fast is taking part and drawing millions of tourists out there. This is your forecast, not looking bad at all. Around average at 19 degrees on Wednesday with a little bit of showers to come. I'll leave you now for extended forecast.